I'm the calculus professor and today I'll be talking to you about improper integrals. In problem number 21, we'd like to evaluate the integral from 0 to infinity of e to the u divided by e to the 2u plus 1 du. All right. Uh, it's easy to see right off the bat that this is an improper integral, so we should write this integral as a limit. So let's rewrite. So this integral is the same thing as writing the limit as b goes to infinity of the integral from 0 to b of e to the u divided by e to the 2u. Now, something that's going to be helpful to me, and so I'm going to write it this way to help us think about it, is this is just e to the u squared. That's the same thing as e to the 2u, but I want to write it this way, e to the u squared plus 1 du. All right, so I rewrote this guy, and the reason I wanted to write this as e to the u squared is because e to the u squared, I can make a very nice substitution here. I'm going to let, let's say, w be e to the u, and then the derivative will be e to the u, which is perfect. So I'm going to let w be equal to e to the u. So dw is going to be e to the u du, which is exactly what I have on the top. So now I can rewrite this integral as the limit as b goes to infinity of the integral of uh, this becomes the whole top is dw and the bottom is w squared plus 1. And we're integrating from, if I plug in 0, I get e to the 0, which is 1. And if I plug in b, I get e to the b. So this is e to the b. All right. Uh, antiderivative here, I have 1 over w squared plus 1. We know that antiderivative is tan inverse of w. So this is equal to the limit as b goes to infinity of tan inverse of w evaluated from 1 to e to the b. All right, so uh, let's plug things in. We get limit as b goes to infinity of tan inverse of e to the b minus tan inverse of 1. Now we're ready to take the limit as b goes to infinity. I take the limit as b goes to infinity. e to the infinity is infinity. Okay, and tan inverse of infinity as tan inverse the <clears throat> as x gets bigger and bigger tan inverse goes towards pi over 2. So this is equal to uh, this whole thing as b goes to infinity becomes pi over 2 minus tan inverse of 1 which is pi over 4. And pi over 2 minus pi over 4 is pi over 4. Uh, so the value of this improper integral is exactly pi over 4.